Vector TAS provides you with a fast, effective means to treat a full range of orthodontic cases. In this occlusal cant case, Vector TAS dramatically simplifies treatment mechanics while providing greater control. After the patient rinses for about 30 seconds with 0.1% chlorhexidine gluconate, thoroughly dry the gingival tissue. Next, apply a small amount of topical anesthetic on the mini screw placement site. Leave the anesthetic on for about two minutes, then wipe thoroughly. Using a needleless injector like the Cirajet, you can deliver a local anesthetic directly into the tissue. Place the instrument flush against the tissue and administer the injection. At this point, you're ready to place the mini screw. Some occlusal can cases may require up to two 8mm mini screws placed between the first and second bicuspids and between the first and second molars. But treatment of this case will require just one 8mm mini screw placed distal to the cuspid. With the screw container in hand, peel back the lid. Keep the tube upright, allowing the pre sterilized screw to remain freely suspended in the tube. Grasp the driver in the opposite hand, aligning and pressing it into the head of the screw. Pull the screw straight back and out of the tube. Then, grip the driver with the bald end firmly seated in your palm while maintaining your forefinger and thumb on the turning shank for control. Place the screw just below the mucogingival junction and advance the screw with firm, constant pressure. Don't allow the screw to wobble, which can widen the hole and increase the chance of failure. When the head of the driver is flush with the tissue, You've driven the mini screw to the proper depth and can detach the driver from the head. You can then check the angulation using an occlusal mirror. Vector TAS offers a full range of springs and other auxiliaries developed specifically for the vectors and forces required in temporary anchorage. This case requires one 150 gram double delta nye tie coil spring. Hook one end of the spring to the head of the mini screw. Thread the spring down and around the arch wire and then attach the second delta loop to the mini screw head. As the maxillary teeth intrude, a lateral open bite will occur. When the maxillary arch levels, close the open bite using the same mini screw to extrude the mandibular teeth. Leveling of this occlusal cant case is estimated to take about three to four months. The total procedure time was performed in less than 10 minutes. Treatment of occlusal cant cases is just the beginning. With Vector TAS, you can achieve a wide range of orthodontic movements to simplify treatment mechanics for cases that may just require space closure, as well as complex cases like anterior open bites and more. Move your cases in the right direction with Vector TAS.